Okay, now with all the fuel system lines, uh, filter, pump, everything in place, I need to go ahead and build a bracket to hold the fuel pump uh, in place above the gas tank. Okay, now with the uh, plumbing and everything exactly where it's going to be, I need to go ahead and build my uh, bracket that's going to hold the fuel pump in place. It's also going to hold this whole assembly pretty rigid. I'm also going to have something that goes around this on the firewall, so this thing will be pretty dang strong. Um, you can see I've cut this t just the top of this piece of 14 gauge pipe out just uh, about 3 eighths of an inch on the edge on both sides and then I bent these tabs over here I got you know, just a little adjustment left to do but I bent the tabs over I've got it underneath here I've got everything put back together exactly the way it goes so I'm clamping down my clamps here with a couple of small vice grips and trying to get this lined up nice and straight to figure out where to drill these holes for this mount. A lot of time building this bracket here. Pretty tricky, but anyway, it's uh, bent here, lined up. Everything's all bolted in. So it's got two screws through here, and then two through this way. When I put this back together later, I'll have the uh, the nylon lock nuts on this stuff. But uh, you can see the uh, pump is mounted on there. The, uh, the bolts are welded to the bottom side. They come up through here. And uh, it doesn't move. It's pretty, pretty solid. I've got this filler tube in here. This is just something that I'm doing right now. It does work. I'm not sure exactly if that's going to be the, the final solution there. I still need to plumb over my rollover vent here having a hard time finding a fitting to come out of here and just go to a, a regular gas line. I'm going to take the gas line and, and go around in a loop around here and then exit here, come up here, come on down there to a charcoal canister down here. So I'm going to get a small charcoal canister, put it right in here, and uh, that should complete the fuel system. Comes from there, through the firewall. up through here. There's the uh, fuel pressure regulator. So basically it's plumbed up.